Hi everybody, I'm Butch Stearns, here to talk to you about the great content shift, the demand for content anywhere, anytime. And when you think about the great content shift, when you get into a discussion about this, any discussion about the people you're working with, about the shifting technologies, about the strategy, about the players, about all of that, very quickly the conversation morphs into mobile. <laughs> it always ends up in mobile, so we're pleased to have with us Michael Boland, who's an analyst and the mobile expert, if you will, the or a mobile expert, I'm not sure, I'll leave that to you, Michael, from BIA Kelsey. Are you the mobile expert, Michael? I would better say the article to use is A, because there are, of course, many of us out there, and it's an area, as you pointed out, everyone's interested in, so there are, there are legions of us experts, so I would, I would say A. Well, for the purpose B. of our discussion, you are the expert, my okay. friend, okay? We'll go with that. So we'll dazzle with us that. with some numbers. We all know that the trend to spending towards mobile is going. How much so? Sure. So what we look at at BIA Kelsey is the um, portion of the overall kind of ad spend in the U.S. that's being put towards different media types. So we're looking at newspapers, yellow pages, radio, television, all of these things. So mobile is, of course, one of those. And that portion is definitely growing. Um, last year, we put the U.S. ad spend going towards mobile advertising at about $1.07 billion, and that's going to grow. We're projecting it to grow almost 60% in 2012 to about $1.61 billion. And this is after um, it grew 50% in 2011, correct? Exactly. So it's, um, it's, it's definitely growing rapidly. We uh, project out to 2015, at least in this particular forecast, we're doing them every year, um, where it's going to reach almost $5 billion. Um, so definitely some, some strong growth there that's outpacing the growth in lots of other media. It's a smaller base, but in terms of growth rate, very much outpacing a lot of other media that we measure. So when we talk about mobile growth, break it down a little further for us. So, you know, you, you already talked about at BIA Kelsey, you'll look at, you know, yellow pages and traditional advertising and mobile as a part of it. But when you get into mobile and you look at the exponential growth, I mean, mobile gets broken down into other areas now too, doesn't it? Absolutely. There are a lot of different uh, kind of ways you can segment these data, and those actually represent how we build that overall number. We build, build it on a lot of different kind of building blocks of the different types of mobile advertising that's out there. Um, there's search advertising, there's display advertising that you see on your typical you know, iPhone app if you're playing Words with Friends or Angry Birds and you see new banner ads. And there's also SMS advertising which you know, people often shrug off SMS and text messaging, but it's still, in terms of device penetration, uh, the most ubiquitous in terms of all the advertising that's out there. So I'm still, I'm still angry ones. when I get those, but I do read them. Yeah, right, right, I exactly. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, there's also segmentation you can look at, the spend which is attributed to geographically targeted mobile advertising. So because the mobile device is right. location aware and knows where you are, the ability for advertisers to target things based on where you are, it leads to better performance and higher relevance for the content. So there's the location targeted segment versus ads that are not location targeted. That's another example of kind of one of the breakdowns. He's Michael Boland, the mobile expert, the mobile expert from BIA Kelsey for the part of our conversation about the great content shift and the 2012 NAB show.